Thanksgiving brings family and friends to the table to celebrate. And by being mindful and planning ahead, you can reduce waste from your family's feast. If you're hosting a gathering for the holiday, take time to plan your shopping list. Only buy what you know you'll use. This is especially important when purchasing perishable items. Skip paper and single-use plastic dishware when plating your meal. Instead, go for reusable cutlery, dishes, and napkins. While it's easy to get excited about your signature recipes and specialties, sometimes our eyes grow bigger than our stomachs. Be mindful of serving sizes and only take what you can eat. You can always go back for more. You can also avoid discarding food by eating what you can first and composting scraps second. When you have extra food, send some home with guests or throw it in the freezer for later. If you're frying a turkey this year, the Oil Recycling Shed at the Eastside Recycling Center and the Iowa City Recycling Center are happy to recycle leftover oil. Place it in a sealed plastic bottle labeled with the oil type once it is fully cooled. The centers will also take your wine corks and glass. For more details, visit icgov.org slash Thanksgiving Tips 2021. Skip the hassle of Black Friday at large stores by supporting small businesses in Iowa City when purchasing seasonal gifts. Choosing to shop local makes a huge impact on our community. The annual holiday market is another great option. You can visit local vendors at the Robert A. Lee Community Recreation Center Saturday, November 13th or December 18th. The market will be held in the first floor gym and the second floor social hall from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. on both dates. Mark your calendars so you don't miss out on all the unique handcrafted gifts and treats. On Thursday, November 11th, the city will observe Veterans Day. Administrative offices and other facilities will be closed, but some city services will operate through the holiday. For a full list of impacted services, visit icgov.org slash Veterans Day 2021. Transit will be open for normal operations. Free rides will be provided for veterans and their families on fixed route city buses and Johnson County seats. Just show a military ID or other identification indicating military status. Crews will also collect trash, organics, and recycling, so make sure to have your bins to the curb if Thursday is your regular pickup day. Our LEAF vacuum program will also be running on Veterans Day. The library will be open from 10 to 6, but no bookmobile. Again, head to icgov.org slash Veterans Day 2021 for the full holiday schedule. If you're looking to get outside, you're in luck as the previously closed segments of the Iowa River Trail have reopened. The portion that had been closed from Highway 6 to McAllister Boulevard was damaged from heavy rains and failure of a stormwater structure under the trail. Those repairs have now been completed. Running throughout Iowa City and the surrounding area, the Iowa River Trail provides residents and visitors alike with an invaluable off-road means of getting around the city. Free public parking for the trail is available at Napoleon Park, City Park, Ned Ashton Park, and Crandick Park. That's all for this episode. Have a great week, everybody. We'll see you next time on Iowa City Update.